We will be discussing Rahul Gandhi's and in fact Congress's Bharat Jodo Nyaya Yatra this time. Congress leader Rahul Gandhi's Bharat Jodo Nyaya Yatra was disrupted on January 22nd when the Assam police prevented him from visiting Bordova Thaan, a shrine and birthplace of 15th-16th century saint reformer Sri Manta Shankaradeva who propagated a neo vaishnav sector. Besides, he was also prevented from holding a meeting in the state's Morigao district citing law and order concerns. Expressing his concerns, Rahul Gandhi in fact questioned the security officials and indirectly criticized Prime Minister Modi. He made a remark that only a single individual could access the temple that day. Jairam Ramesh, Congress's General Secretary in charge of communications, went further to claim that, the, the, uh, that this particular decision had been influenced by pressure from the state government. Why आज कम से कम राम का बात करो ना कम से कम 500 साल का बात आज हमें सब राम का बात करना चाहिए आज कम से कम रावण का बात नहीं करना चाहिए ये बिल्कुल साफ हो गया है कि ये एक उनकी रणनीति हमेशा रही है कि राहुल जी को यहां ना आने दिया जाए क्यों मैं नहीं बता सकता आप लोग सब जानते हैं आज का दिन क्या हो रहा है सारे चैनल सारे अखबार सारे खबर सारे एजेंसियां सिर्फ एक ही विषय पर फोकस कर रहे हैं हो सकता है हमारे अहंकाचार्य नहीं चाहते हैं कि और किसी विषय पर देश की निगाहें हों देखिए आप मेरे विचार से इस देश में दुनिया में ब्रह्मांड में कनकन में ईश्वर का बास होता है आपका मन अगर साफ हो तो ईश्वर का दर्शन कहीं भी होता है लेकिन चिंताजनक बात ये है कि एक तरफ मंदिर में आने का निमंत्रण दिया जाता है दूसरी तरफ मंदिर जाने से रोका जाता है तो मुझे लगता है कहीं ना कहीं धर्म को ईश्वर को और लोगों की आस्था को अपनी राजनीति का हथियार बनाया जा रहा है so that was the latest update we have about Congress's Bharat Jodo and Nyaya Yatra this time. Rahul Gandhi, in fact, said that his uh, journey was disrupted on January 22nd when the Assam police prevented him from uh, visiting Bordova Thaan, a shrine and a birthplace of 15th, 16th century saint reformer Sri Manta Shankara Deva, who propagated a neo Vaishnav sector. Uh, besides, he was also prevented from holding a meeting in the state's Morigao district is what we are learning, citing the law and order concerns. Expressing his concerns, Rahul Gandhi questioned the security officials and indirectly criticized the Prime Minister Modi as well. They criticized the state government as well. Uh, he made this remark that only a single individual could uh, access the temple that day, which was January 22nd, yesterday, which was a historic day as far as the Pran Pratishthan in Ayodhya is concerned. Jairam Ramesh, Congress's General Secretary in charge of communications, went in fact further to claim that this particular decision of disrupting Bharat Jodo Nyaya Yatra of Congress had been influenced by pressure from the state government. We also heard what Himant Biswa Sarma had to say. Apart from that, these uh, are the claims that are being made from Congress's side as well that their journey was disrupted on January 22nd. We have uh, CNN News 18's Preeti Priyadarshani joining us on the broadcast to bring us more details about what exactly transpired there on the ground. Preeti, a very good morning to you what is congress currently saying where was his, uh, where was their journey disrupted also if you were to talk about what's in the bag for today what more details do we have a lot of things actually happening during this uh, Congress's uh, Nyaya Yatra that Rahul Gandhi has led and today he is entering Guwahati. Until yesterday also there were a lot of uh, controversies happening about this Nyaya Yatra where first he was denied, uh, he, he, they have alleged that he was denied uh, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the, we can say the permissions for the Yatra in Manipur and then he has now entered Guwahati where he has asked, he has been asked to not disrupt the normal life of Cell City. But you can see a lot of traffic has already started and uh, Rahul Gandhi this Nyaya Yatra is on the way 
uh, by which he will um, he might try to enter the city as we have been informed by the sources in congress but yesterday also there were a lot of uh, we can say a controversies about uh, uh, co congress's nyay yatra being disrupted however the state government authorities have uh, time and again being state they have stated that uh, nobody is stopping the yatra but we can say that uh, they are actually being asked not to disrupt the normal life of the common people because uh, a lot of traffic happens when such kind of yatras take place for which he has been asked to take the highway but uh, it will be seen in a few minutes that you can see a lot of security arrangements are being made where uh, a lot of barricades are being put so that he cannot enter the main traffic main city of uh, the, the guwahati and he might have to take the highway and uh, he will have to go to hajo he will after this he will go to hajo and then he will go to barpeta where his yatra will end today but we have seen that uh, in yesterday while the, the pran pratishtha was taking place in ayodhya he was trying to enter the batadrava uh, satra where he was denied permission by the satra dikars uh, to enter and offer prayers however the local mp we can say the uh, the congress mp of assam uh, gorav gogoi was allowed to enter you can see that ambulances are in, in the traffic jam a lot of traffic congestion here in khanapara guwahati which is the main route to the city so which is why the state government and the city authorities have uh, time and again stated that uh, they should not take the city route uh, which is why also uh, there are a lot of security arrangements being made a lot of uh, we can say a lot of uh, barricades also being put in this way in khanapara where he will be stopped by the authorities uh, by not by not allowing him to enter the city however he and his congress party are all very much resolved to take the route through the city but it will be only seen in a few minutes through which route they will be taking this yatra uh, through which route they will continue this yatra hmm. i can try to i will try to show you the visuals of uh, the traffic and you can already see that uh, people with posters are waiting here and uh, the yatra is on its way this is khanapara from where right. we are reporting uh, and we can see that in the morning in the morning as well there were a few meetings being held in uh, the assam meghalaya border right uh, so you can see the apologies for interrupting you over there that's all the time we have for that story